Okay, this is Ji Wu, and I'm going to do a quick screencast on how to set up the console in a Windows environment. So, first thing I'm going to do is bring up my Windows here, and I'm going to go into my computer, and then I'm going to get my properties. And here I've got my system properties. I'll go into the advanced tab, and then my environment variables. And here I've got my path down here. So what I want to do is put my CLI and my K console in the path. So I'm going to add a little separator. And then I'm going to point at my CLI, which is in WAMP slash PHP. I install the latest WAMP 1 or 5.17. And then I'm going to point it at my cake install, which for me is in www slash cake slash 1.2.x slash cake slash console. So I installed the base app in cake slash 1.2 and then I'm just going to add in cake console there. So that all looks good. I should be able to click OK. OK there. And now what I can do is open up my command prompt which is in the accessories here. And I can move this down into here. And since I put it in my environment variables, I should be able to run cake. And now I've got everything set up for cake. And you can see my path there, which is my document settings. So what I might do here instead, what I'm going to do is I'm going to change into my web root slash WAMP slash www. And now if I run cake from here, you should be able to see that my paths have changed to reflect my new directory. So now when I'm running any of the cake shells, I can run them from this directory or any of the other directories. So that's a simple tutorial on how to set up the cake shell on Windows. Happy baking!